it's one of a lot of pride to have been able to play for my boyhood club. I've said it in many interviews before, I remember as I think as a 10 year old lad, sat in one of the stands and watching Keith Wood score a try. Um, four, four quins and that kind of just really sparked my love of the club being a local club and a local boy. So huge amount of pride, um, sadness to be, to be hanging up my boots. Um, but yeah, I've, I've experienced some amazing things at the club over, over the years that I've been here. Being able to play with my brother is definitely an emotional factor. Um, been so privileged to win the two Premiership titles, the Challenge Cup, the LV Cup, playing the Challenge Cup final. It's been an amazing journey, one I'm extremely proud of. I hope to continue to work in, in rugby. It's what I love, it's my, my passion. And you know, I, I'm very grateful to all the people that have helped get me to this point today, whether it be school coaches, club coaches, academy coaches that gave me the chance and obviously first team coaches that I've experienced. So it's been an amazing journey and obviously extremely grateful my family and my wife, my kids, my friends that have supported me through thick and, thick and thin. It's, it's sometimes not an easy journey, professional rugby, and they've been there in the hardest moments, but they've, it's been great to be able to to celebrate those with them. Um, you know, mum and dad have travelled a lot, a lot of the country and so has my wife. So, and obviously extremely grateful for all the support over the years from, from the Quinns faithful, travelling far and wide, whether it be to Welford Road, King's Home or being at the Stoop. There's, there's no better place to play as a professional rugby player than, uh, than playing at the Stoop when it's packed out and the Quinns fans all cheering for you. So a massive thank you to everyone at at Harlequins for their support over the years.